hello guys in this video we will create connection string for a queue in service bus and then we will also understand connection string for queue versus connection string for namespace so let's go to the portal so we are in the portal and let's open this service bus namespace and the queue within the namespace and on left hand side if you observe we have settings and then shared access policy see this settings shared access policy here we will add a policy that means a connection string for this service bus queue will be created and let's do that so we'll click on add you can give any name so i'll say my queue policy let's say manage that means uh, with this connection string we can send as well as receive the message create It's created and if I open this, see we have this primary connection string and secondary connection string. We also have primary key and secondary key as well. So let's close this. Let's go to the home again. Uh, let's open that namespace again. And now guys, again let's go to settings and shared access policy. Now guys, we are in shared access policies for this namespace. Earlier, we created an access policy for a queue within that namespace. And now here, if you see, we have this root manage shared access key. And if I open this, we again have connection strings and primary secondary key. Now, this access policy was created by Azure by default when we created the namespace for the first time okay and as we can guess with this connection string we can use or we can connect to all the queues and topics within this namespace but ideally whenever we are working on with a specific queue or topic we should use the connection string for that specific queue or topic only and with that we can enforce least privilege access policy okay but then there are some cases when we need to use a connection string at namespace level. For example, when we are working with cross entity transactions, we will be using connection string at namespace level. So guys, don't worry if even if you are not getting it completely, we will see it in our upcoming videos. Thank you.